I got my fingers in the dirt and a one, two, three. Got on my garden shirt and with sunny set up. It's a beautiful day. Well, well, well. I wonder what gifts of capitalist propaganda we've got this week from the multinationals. Oh, look at that, eh? Beautiful. Oranges all the way from Australia, never mind the carbon footprint. Look at These supermarket flyers, look at it. Australian table grapes, American pears. It's a regular little United Nations of food you can't afford. $1.75 for a lettuce. I reckon for $1.75 we can produce about 100 lettuces. That makes them about one and three quarter cents each. Let's make this useless capitalist propaganda into something useful. All we've got to add is a bit of sunshine, a bit of water, and a little bit of care. So here's my secret weapon. I borrowed this from my mate Brian. He's been onto this lark for years. This is a fantastic little machine. This can turn useless supermarket flyers into gold and feed your family. Best of all, we're going to cut ourselves a strip of useless supermarket flyer. Chop, 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 as Chopper Reed would say. Beautiful. We're going to wrap that round the tool. All very high tech, this. Takes years to learn. It's a nine year apprenticeship. Tuck the ends in. Fit the tool together. Here we have it. Perfect little planting pot. I did actually develop this skill during my paper dolly phase. Oh, beautiful. Now the great thing about these little paper pots that we've made is they're free and you don't have to unpot the plant when you're transplanting. When you transplant a, a small seedling, it's quite a shocking experience being dehoused like that. And they, they go into shock and it can often cost you a week's growing time. But with this little pot, everything goes in the ground. A little worm will come up and have a nibble at it and the pot will rot away. So it doesn't go through transplant shock. And nobody is transplant shocking my veggies. Transplant shock is a dirty little thing you want to watch out for that one. I'm taking a long away. Faster growing, quicker eating. Just ordinary old potting mix down the hole. About five bucks a bag potting mix. You can do hundreds of plants for five bucks. Good idea to uh, make sure that you uh, wash the spoon before you put it back in the spoon drawer. Otherwise you can get a bit of a growling domestically. Today we're going to do silver beet and, and broccoli. This is my favourite silver beet, bright lights, because it comes in a whole bunch of different colours. And the nutritionists are telling me that these bright colours are the ones to go for. They'll grow your kids really good. I need the glasses for this bit. Too much useless processed supermarket food over the years has screwed my eyesight. Here we go. And quite a nice size seed these, so you can actually, you can see them. One of those in each pot. And we just tamp them down. Beautiful, they are ready to go. Now as Julia Childs would say, uh, here's one I prepared earlier. If you look carefully into here, you can see a couple of confident little starters. These have been in about a week and they're just starting to pop their heads through. That's going to be lovely little uh, red beet. And three or four weeks down the line, have a look at these guys. They're really starting to rocket away and they're ready to get in the ground and do some serious growing. Righto, let's go get them in the ground. Straight into the bed, no mucking about, beautiful eh? All ready, nice and simple, see that little pot's all soft, little root here starting to pop through. We haven't had to take the seedling out of the pot and it's not going to get the shock. In the hole, Dunsky. So here you have it, you've finally got a use for that supermarket flyer, it can do some good for the world and grow some stuff for your kids. Brian's little magic tool, any good Kiwi could knock it up out of two bits of wood, maybe a bit of bamboo, possibly something in the kids' toys department. I got my fingers in the dirt and a one, two, three, got on my gardening shirt and my sunny set up, it's a beautiful day. <laughs> Alright then, I'm a rolling in the truck and sowing my seeds, so we don't gotta pay much for the food that we need. I said it before, but now you've been knowing the brothers and sisters 
We gotta get growing.